Hey guys, it's Catherine, and today I'm going to be filming a back to school haul. So most of the items I'm going to be showing you I actually bought when I went to Florida and uh, I went to a lot of department stores so I'm probably just going to be reading the the brand name off of the tag in the shirts instead of telling you exactly where I got it from just so I don't know you can maybe narrow down I don't know I'll try to find everything online but if I can't obviously it won't be listed down below but I'll try or really try okay okay I also did some shopping uh, today so I'm gonna be showing you some stuff that I bought today so the first thing I got is just a simple white v-neck t-shirt and it's from um, the brand mud so I think this is sold at Kohl's and I just got it in a size up so it would be super loose the next item I got is just this navy blue and white romper which actually already shrunk in the wash I'm gonna have to like try to stretch it out or I'm gonna have to end up giving it away but anyways so it's just very breezy it cinches in at the waist and this is from J for justify the next item I got is just this very flowy and kind of, it's kind of thick so this would be good for the fall time but it's also good for the summer and it's just this high neck red dress, it goes very flowy at the bottom and this is from Vibe Sportswear. The next dress I got is just this off the shoulder blue dress, I can't really tell what kind of fabric this is but it, it kind of looks ribbed but it's not and this is from the brand Persea yeah and yeah it's just very flowy nothing fitted perfect for early back to school the next dress I got is similar to the red dress because it's high neck but it has a rib detailing and it's black and like the red dress it's just very flowy at the bottom and this is from the brand polyester so it's a play on polyester but it's not polyester you feel me? The next two items I got are actually from Walmart and they're these two bralettes and these bralettes are so cute and they support your girls very nicely. So I just got this blue color and I just got it in black as well. And what's cool about these is you can actually unhook the straps and crisscross them. The next item I got is just this black top from the brand Occasion and it has that lace up detailing here and it's kind of see-through so you would obviously wear a black bra with this so I think you'd be, you'd be fine. It's kind of cropped but it's still long so it doesn't show that much of your stomach. Next I got this ribbed grey bodysuit and it also has the lace up detailing and this is from the brand Dan B. And yeah, it's just really cute, nice to wear with jeans, wear with a skirt, you can wear this with anything, honestly. The next item I got is also a bodysuit with the lace-up detailing, and you're gonna see that I'm very into the khaki green, olive green color this season. And this is from the brand Say What? Like, say what? Yeah. <laughs> and it's just really pretty, it flows nicely, like the other bodysuits, you can wear it with honestly anything. The next top I bought is just this striped top with the ribbed, is this called ribbed? I don't know what this is called when it has like, you know, this thing. Anyways, it's just very cute. It's blue, white, and red, and it's from the brand Love J. Next, I just got this simple black v-neck, and it's from Active USA. There's, excuse you, there's uh, nothing else I can say about it. It's just a simple black t-shirt. The last two items I picked up in Florida are these very breezy airy shorts black shorts that they have a cool little design at the end with some crochet if you can see that i don't know if that's called a crochet actually anyways they just cinch in at they're kind of high-waisted but not really and they're very flowy like i said so it's perfect for summer the shorts were from a brand called angie so I just got these black shorts from H&M and they're just simple high-waisted black shorts, cut-off shorts, very cute, very nice. Lastly, I went to H&M today and I picked up two things. So the first thing I picked up is this high neck crop top, like I said, it's in the olive green khaki color and it's just 
very simple. It was in the basics section. It's perfect to pair with high-waisted shorts, high-waisted jeans, high-waisted skirt. You can layer some sweaters on it, but for the fall, it's very versatile or versatile. Versatile. I don't know how to say that word. Everyone says differently. Potato, potato. And the next thing I got is just this khaki green skirt, and it's kind of similar to the Topshop skirt, but it's not. It's from H&M, so it was cheaper, but the quality is still very nice, and it goes super high waisted. So moving on to the shoes, I just got this pair of Steve Madden shoes, and they're lace ups, lace them up your ankle, and they're really cool on, and they look very nice. So. They were so nice, I had to get them in both colors because like, brown and black, you need them. Shh, don't yell at me, okay? Next, I just got a pair of classic pointed pumps from Nine West, but they were actually on sale. I found them, I, okay, I found these shoes at Marshalls on sale for 24 bucks. Like, come on. Come on. How could you, you can't pass these up. You really can't. They're so classic. You can pair them with honestly anything and they'll look great. They'll make your legs look great. They'll make your calves look bomb. Okay, ladies, you need, you all need a pair of pointed pumps. Moving on to the bags, I'm keeping with the Nine West trend and I got this Nine West color block. Not really color block, but like gray, kind of taupey gray and black purse and what's really cool about it obviously it comes with a shoulder chain but it has two compartments and a middle zipper compartment so if you need to go somewhere you can keep your wallet in the zipper compartment so you don't lose it and it just very it's very spacious you can use this to travel because it's very spacious and I know it might be a bit bulky for traveling so like honestly just use it whenever you want Next, I just got this Michael Kors tote bag, and this is actually the bag I'm going to be using for school. I really like it because it's that material that's water and like rain resistant, water resistant, snow resistant, stuff like that. Just has a little zipper in the front, and then it's just a simple tote inside. It kind of has, it has four compartments and a zipper compartment inside, so that's really good. So it'll help me stay organized. And what I really like about this bag is the black and brown. I just find it's really different. And it, I, I find it different because it's not all one color, it's not all black, you know? It kind of breaks it up and it's really nice and I love it. Now we're moving on to the beauty stuff. I got this bag full of goodies. Don't worry, it's not all from Sephora. I can contain myself, okay? So I'm just gonna be pulling stuff out at random and let's go. So we're going to start off with nail polish. I actually got this Essie, um, I think this is the shellac collection that they came out with because it's a twisted bottle. It's not straight like usual. I got the color Somi instead of Sumi, you know, but it's Somi. It's the, uh, the shade in 30 and I haven't tried it yet, but when I do, I will let you know how long it lasts and all that jazz. Where do I put this? Okay, I'm just gonna be putting stuff here. Just don't, don't be attention. I'm kind of a mess today. I think it's the heat. It's getting to me, and I'm very like, like, ugh. I don't even know what that was. I just need to take a moment. I need to cool down a bit. It's not gonna happen. Let me just continue. Okay, the next thing I got is this highlight palette from Profusion, and it just has five shades of highlight. I actually used it in my Oceaga Get Ready With Me. I used the light pink shade. I'll read you all the names. So the first one is a white pearl. The second one is pale gold, champagne, light pink, and golden bronze. It was, yeah, it was very cheap. It was six bucks at Marshalls. So I just wanted to try out something cheaper because I haven't really gotten a high-end highlight yet and I just wanted to see what kind of color highlight I like and so far I've been loving the pink highlight because I think the golden bronze and champagne um, they'll be nice for darker skin tones but because this is a cheaper palette it's not too pigmented so that fairer skin tones can also use it. Lordy lord, it's so hot. Okay, the next 
item I got is this e.l.f. blush in the shade Blushing. Wow, so unique with the names e.l.f. And like I said, I'll include swatches. So this is kind of like a pinky, shimmery blush. It's very nice for fair skin tones because I have fair skin. I don't know if it'll look good on your skin tone. So you gotta just try them out. I'll include a swatch. Swatch. Oh my. I can't speak today. I don't know what's happening. I'm very loopy. I don't know what's happening. Okay. Next, I got this L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Blush in the shade Neutral. So, oh, it's not in the shade Neutral. What the heck? Why did I notice this? It's in the shade Precious Peach. So, um, I don't. This is a matte. Oh no, it's kind of shimmery. Next, I got La Bomba, like bomb stuff, like, like a lip balm from the Bomb Cosmetics. And it's just this uh, quad eyeshadow palette. And these eyeshadows are so nice. Like this merengue, would, like I used it as, oh, I used it as a highlighter. Like it. Oh, it's so nice. Actually, I use this palette to do Leanna's makeup, so I'm gonna include like a little video here if she lets me. We'll see. Cause like I was very proud of that makeup. Okay, the next thing I got is this Jouer Liquid Lipstick. Hold on, I got something white on me. What the heck? It's this Jouer Liquid Lipstick in the shade Orchid, and it's, it says it's a lip cream. And it's actually the shade I'm wearing today, but because of the lighting, you it's kind of lighter than it is in real life. Again, I'll include a swatch, you'll see it, don't worry about it. Ah. Next, I just got this Lorac Tantalizer Baked Bronzer. This thing is so hard to open though. When I opened it, I had my long nails on when I opened it and I like clawed out some of the product, but it is a really nice product, so. All right, now these I'm super excited for. If I can get them out. Oh God, okay, hold on. So I went to Kohl's and they had this Kohl's exclusive collection for Lorac lip glosses and lipsticks and first of all this whole pack was only 34 bucks which guys that's so good each lipstick is like 17 bucks and each and, and each lip gloss is 16 so I got three lipsticks and three lip glosses for 34 bucks like do the math that is good okay got these three lipsticks and these three lip glosses and lip glosses match the lipsticks so you can wear them on top of each other you can mix and match the colors um, you can really just do anything with them and this is a summer collection so I'll read you the names so in the lipsticks we have trophy wife which is this bright pinky coral color we have entrepreneur which is kind of like a terracotta um, brown kind of red lipstick then we have Ballerina, which is this lilac, like bright lilac. Then, oh, hold on. Same shades, just in a lip gloss and a lipstick. What does it say? It says highly pigmented lipstick and the lip gloss is highly pigmented lip gloss. So yeah, they're exactly the same, just lip gloss, lipstick. Woo, we're down to the last thing, guys. I'm so excited because I'm sweating. So I actually... So I actually picked this up today. It's the Too Faced Boudoir Eyes and it says Soft and Sexy Eyeshadow Collection. Three steps, three looks, three minutes. I don't know about three minutes. All right, so I'm just gonna take it out of the packaging. I'm so excited. I'm so excited to use this. Maybe I'll do a makeup look with this. Let me know in the comments if you wanna see a makeup look with this. So this is what it looks like. It's just so pretty. Oh my God. It has like in the background like a quilted like leather couch or something or leather headboard that's what it looks like and it just says Too Faced Boudoir Eyes and yeah I'll probably show you a close-up of the shades but this is what they look like from far you probably can't see anything don't worry I'll show you all oh, my other so nice 
All right guys, so I've decided for this palette, I'm actually not gonna show you any swatches because I'm thinking of doing a first impressions makeup look with it. So if you're down for that, leave a comment down below, like this video, whatever you wanna do to let me know that you'd be willing to watch it or you wanna watch it, whatever. Also, I forgot to show this cap because I'm a terrible YouTuber, but it just says, life is good and it's in this navy blue color and also on the inside it's really cute it says do what you like and like what you do so cute all right guys so i hope you enjoyed that video please give it a like if you did subscribe to my channel if you're not already and comment something down below because i love reading comments and I'll see you guys next video. Bye.